So working in real estate, there's really been two ingredients that have helped me to success. And I've really focused on the wrong one recently. So I'd like to share the, the learning experience I went through. So hopefully you don't make that mistake with these principles that can really apply to anything. So, hey, it's Chad Landberg coming to you today. And I hope that you gain some value from this video. Uh, so the two skills are really, I would, I would call it systems and processes and discipline. Um, I'm a systems and processes nerd. Anybody that knows me how, knows how systemized I am, whether it is my personal life or my work life. And I, have, I will lean into systems and processes like you won't believe. I will make sure I have the most robust and automated and efficient and, and everything talks to each other system you can think of. But that doesn't really move the needle. It is valuable. It is something that reduces uh, the time spent on a task, it's something that can, enables you to scale more. It's something that you know can raise the ceiling, essentially. If you have a ceiling of what you can do as a human being, just like technology should, it raises that ceiling so you can do more in the same amount of time. So systems and processes are definitely very valuable and they were a huge part of what I've scaled so far. But discipline is the more important skill set. And it's almost like I forgot that I have it. I've still been very disciplined, but not on the right things. So my learning lesson that I personally went through here in the last couple months has been being disciplined to do things that actually move the needle. And you know, the easiest analogy or the easiest way to equate this to most people is if you look at working out, right? If you work out seven days this week, two days next, one the week after, and then you know maybe seven again, like if you're sporadic like that and not truly disciplined, you're not gonna see results. You'll probably eventually quit and get away because you're not getting rewarded with seeing changes for what you're spending your time on. As opposed to if you just take a four or five day a week discipline and go consistently every single week at some point, and this is the problem, is you don't know when, at some point you will see the results you want to see. So discipline is everything. And really everybody thinks there's a magic pill. And I have searched and searched and spent a lot of money and a lot of time ultimately to find out, to be honest with you really recently, that there just isn't one. The only magic that exists is discipline. And the people you see succeeded are simply just more disciplined. And they're applying that discipline over time to lead to the things they want. And if you don't think it's magic, I literally tell you, if you stay disciplined and work out five times a week, period, won't you get in shape, which is what you want? Isn't that magic? If you do this, you get this, right? That's what we're looking for on all these magic pills, on all these solutions and all you know I buy this and I'm, my life is going to be better things that exist out there so for me personally I'm gonna become and already have over the last four or three or four months but I'm going to going to become super disciplined in my health my relationships and my wealth my, my, my work my business building there's a simple structure I'm going to follow in all three of those things so that I can finally get those things that I've been searching for at each of those levels. So discipline is something that will apply in anything you're doing. And this is why you see, you know, this is why I think we watch pro sports because we see the discipline of these athletes to achieve such great things uh, in the sport that they're doing because they've been so disciplined with their training to build the skills necessary to do those great things. So. That's been a huge revelation for me, especially this summer. So it's something I wanted to share with you and I hope, you, I hope that you find that valuable and maybe you know, you're know you searching for that magic pill. I'm gonna tell you to just cut that journey out, find a simple plan and stick, stick to that plan and stay disciplined and you'll finally get what you're looking for on the other side. So thanks for tuning in. This is Chad Lienberg here today and I hope that was valuable. Tell me your thoughts, you know, if you think discipline is a valuable skill set or if you've got a cheat code that exists that you're going to prove me wrong, I'd love to love to hear that because you just know it's not true. So, leave a comment, you know, if you found this valuable or if you have that cheat code that you found, uh, but thanks for tuning in and we'll see you on the next one.